So I saw The Expendables 2, and this is my spoiler-free review. Hey, that rhymes! So, because this review doesn't contain spoilers, I'm not going to be going into the plot, and therefore it's, it's just a short review. Let me start off by saying that I didn't really have high hopes for this movie. Expendables 1 was fairly poor in my humble opinion, so I went in with low expectations, and let me say that it did improve somewhat, but still fell below the mark. It suffered from a slightly less poor story than the first, but that was suffocated by, dare I say it, modern action. It certainly wasn't the type of gripping action that you would see in an 80s classic which it claims to embrace. Instead, the action is dished out by teams of elite soldiers with state-of-the-art weapons, not the classic premise for an 80s action film. Anyway, the movie did do some things better than the first one, in my opinion. For one, it had considerably more screen time for Schwarzenegger, which is always a plus for me anyway, and also more Bruce Willis, and some Van Damme as well, I like him a lot, um, so that was great to see those. I also liked the script better as well. Um, it was loaded with references to 80s classics that these guys were actually in, so you know, it's sort of like uh, they're parodying themselves at times, which I think was really funny and fun, and you know, it worked pretty well. Okay, so in summary, uh, this movie beats the first one in a few ways, but still has uh, much to work on before it can stand up to the 80s action classics. That's just my opinion. It's, it's probably not my type of movie. Well, it well, definitely isn't my type of movie, but still, it's, it's not bad. Thanks for watching. I'm Lenny. Bye-bye.